What's up guys, I'm Brian. I'm Mark. And I'm Maury. Today we've got one from Hill Farmstead Brewery out of Vermont. Thanks to Brian for putting this one up. This is the Elaborative 3, Imperial Stout Aged in Bourbon Barrels. Um, not sure if the details are on here. Yeah, okay. It was brewed in March of 2014, so it was coming right up on four years old. Um, brewed with uh, Brad Clark from Jackie O's. Um, and it has Rapidura. It's an unrefined cane sugar uh, that they used to brew this stout and then aged it for 20 months in a variety of barrels. Sweet. So ABV, um, let me see. I don't know if it's on here. 500 milliliter bottle. Yeah, I'll get you the ABV if I can, but uh, we're gonna go ahead and get into this one. We'll let you know what we think about it. Oh boy, boozy. Boozy and rich. Yeah. Some roastiness, a little bit of dark chocolate, bourbon. Or sugary. Yeah. Other than that, that sugar that they added. If yeah. It's that or just the sweetness, yeah. Yeah, there's a sweetness to it. Mm. A little bit of a like a molasses character yeah. in there as well. Basically, all the your typical stout aromas. Mm -hmm. right. I mean, I wouldn't say the bourbon is in your face, but you could definitely get it. You could, yeah, yeah. If you you're doing this blind, I would definitely guess it's towards bourbon. Yeah, oh, for sure. Yeah. Well, it, it really coats the glass. Too, it right? may be on the nose, you know, even though you do get that sugary element, it doesn't smell mm -hmm. like it's going to be overly sweet, at least on the nose. Let's, yeah. you know, find out. Cheers. Cheers. Wow. Oh, it's definitely sweeter than... Yeah. Wow, that sugar. Yeah. <clears throat> Boy, I mean, that it really coats, coats your lips wow, with a lot of sweetness thick. and sugary. Coats your palate, coats the lips. Yeah. The alcohol kind of... I mean, it's not real... Uh, there's not really a burn to it. I mean, I feel like it's pretty mellow. Um, but, I mean, you can definitely get the bourbon off of it. It's sticky. Yeah. You know what I mean? It def that sugar has a stickiness to the mouthfeel. But there's a, on a back end, it's it's that barrel almost thins it out a little bit. Sure. Definitely get the wood notes, definitely get some bourbon character. Right. More bourbon on the taste than on the nose. Agreed, yeah. Great flavor. Yeah, that sugariness of that. It's sweet right up front, but, it's but it has a nice, it's, yeah, it's not cloying. No, I mean, And it has that <clears throat> nice kind of roasty molasses yeah. flavor on the back yeah. end, uh, along with the ABV keeping that sweetness yeah. in check, I think. Oh, yeah, that, that's it. It does. It balances it out nice. You know, you, yeah. think, you think from the smell and from the taste, at, at first, you think it's it might be a little bit too sweet, but yeah, it just... That the finish <coughs> isn't that good. It's no. so sweet in the yeah, front and right. middle. It's got but a good it really finishes. Finish also. Yeah. I mean, it's not thin. It's not nicely carbonated. It's almost yeah. four years old, and it still yeah, no. still has a, comes up I with mean, a the head on there. It said 15 is when bottled that was bottled. 15. So okay. Sad. So brewed in March, bottled in 15. Right. Okay. I'm at, honestly, an easy four and a half. Um, I'm really kind of digging the all over flavors of it. Uh, the sugariness to it isn't killing it. Um, it's got a nice bourbon to it. Um, and I'm, uh, I mean, it's pretty much, you know, an all stout characteristics of what we look for. Yeah. Um, but I'm going to stick to a four and a half. All right. Yeah. I was, uh, I was between four and a half and four, seven, five. I'm going to go with a four and a half. Um, it is pretty sweet. It is nicely balanced, honestly, for this type of stout. Um, got some nice bourbon character, nice oaky, Woodiness kind of thins it on the back end to help that balance. Uh, but yeah, we get a solid four and a half. It's a damn good, damn good beer. Yeah, I'm at a four and a half too. I love the flavors on it. I know you guys said you were pretty cool with the body on it. I think it could use a little bit more. There's that nice stick, sticky mm. sugariness to the beer, uh, but actually it kind of drinks more of the <clears throat> mouthfeel of a thicker barley wine to me. I could use just a little bit more, and I'd be at that 475 because mm -hmm. I love the flavors. Yes, yeah, it right. is getting close to life. Yeah. yeah. So thank nice. you so much for sharing yeah, this one because it's excellent. Anytime, guys. And until next time. Cheers. Cheers.